and Pretty Public Library. Welcome to a Young Artist Club video. This is my friend Annabella, and she and I are going to show you today our second uh, art uh, project. It is we're going to decorate a candle for you can use it either to decorate your room or you can do, use it for your Thanksgiving table this year. So everything that you need is going to be in your brown um, bag, your kit, and you're going to have a candle holder. It's glass, so be careful with it. It's pretty sturdy, but you want to be careful when you're handling glass. So this is your candle holder. You're going to have a little electronic candle. If you look on the inside, on the, on the bottom, you're going to see a little switch and you can turn it on. You're also going to have a paintbrush. You're going to have baggies with uh, tissue paper, different colors. Here we have orange, red, brown, and gold. Uh, we picked those because they're nice Thanksgiving colors. And you're also going to have a little cup full of white liquid. This isn't glue. This is something called Mod Podge. And it's good for, it's almost like glue, but it, um, it's more um, uh, water resistant. So it won't get um, ruined if you get this wet. Although when you're done, you shouldn't wash this, especially not in the dishwasher. All right, Annabella, you have everything we need? Yes. All right, let's get started. This is really easy. So what you're gonna do, your, um, if your candle holder has a sticker, you're gonna wanna take it off. Make sure you get everything off. And I did it. <laughs> okay, no problem. You want me to help you? I know, I have nails. If you don't have nails, you can ask mom or dad to help you. All right, there you go. And then basically all that we're gonna be doing, Annabella, is we're gonna be applying these tissues to the outside of the candle. And the way we're gonna make them stick is with the Mod Podge. So the only thing to be careful of is that you don't wanna put the Mod Podge all over your candle holder at first, because then by the time you get to some parts of it, it might dry. So you just want to put a little bit of Mod Podge in a section at a time. So you're going to figure out what colors you're going to want. You can do whatever design you want. You can do stripes. I like to just kind of mix it all around. So you're going to take your paintbrush and you're going to dip it into your Mod Podge. And you're just going to spread it on a small section of it. You don't want to do the bottom yet, okay? And you want to make sure that you get to the top edge. You got it. And then you're just going to pick and just place your tissue paper however you want. Whatever colors you want, whatever design you want. They can be overlapping. Like, it doesn't have to be perfectly put. And then you just want to tap it down a little bit. Don't worry if it doesn't stick completely because we're going to go over it again. So you see I'm like overlapping line. Just going to put a little bit there. How are you doing? I think I'm going to put two. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah, sometimes you get two. I'll put some gold. Yeah, you got it. And you can keep going around to the next section. You're going to want to have some sort of paper um, on the table or a tablecloth like we have so that it doesn't get too dirty. How are you doing? Okay. Any more brown on mine. You want to take your time.
also because we are uh, approaching Thanksgiving, I have a couple of questions for you, Miss Damaris mm -hmm. and Annabella. What are your favorite sides for Thanksgiving and why? Um, well, we always have rice and beans for Thanksgiving, so I love my rice and beans. What about you, Annabella? Uh, I really like um, deviled eggs. My mother makes them, Ooh. and I she always makes them, so I love them so much. Sounds good. And what are you guys thankful for? I'm thankful for good friends, and this year for good health. Awesome. How about you? I'm thankful for mom. Okay. Did you say mama was going to say hint? The answer to that is always mom. I know. <laughs> I'm thankful for my family, especially my mother and my brothers and my dad. And um, I'm just thankful for having good health. I'm thankful for my health and my family and co-workers. Miss Annabella, can you please pull up your mask? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> How are you doing there, Annabella? Let's do a close-up. Okay. So you can see, oh, one thing I didn't mention was that it's easiest if you hold it like this. Like I put my fingers inside the candle holder and I hold it like that. And that makes it easier to move it around. And that way I'm not holding onto the tissue paper. Pretty easy, huh? Yes. But you get a nice decoration. This would also make, you can do it for Thanksgiving, but if you want to hold on to it, you can make, it would make a nice present for mom too. Mm -hmm. I would love one. For the holidays. So, Ms. Damaris, your technique is just putting them on top of each other? Yeah, sometimes, like, I overlap them. Okay. But it's up to the artist. If you mm -hmm. want to be, some people like being more precise, and they like to uh, lay each one out, like, in a pattern, like, perfectly like that. And that's fine, too. Um, you're the artist, so whatever looks good to you. Well, while Annabella finishes there, once you have it covered, you want to go over again and gently spray an, um, spread another coat of the Mod Podge over it. That's going to glue down some of the pieces that you didn't might not have gotten completely uh, flat. It's also going to put a layer of coating onto it so that um, the tissue paper is protected. And you want to be gentle when you do this because if you're too rough, you're going to move or tear the tissue. And if you want, you can also do the bottom. You want to make sure you cover before you start doing it again. Just look around and make sure that you don't see any of the glass so that you cover it. Make sure you covered everything with um, a piece of tissue paper. All right. So 
I'm done. When you're done, this part you're going to get a little wet, a little dirty. You're going to take it and you're going to put it down and you're going to let it uh, sit. Probably overnight is best. And all this is white now, it's going to be nice and clear. You're not going to be able to see the Mod Podge at all. And then when you're done, it's ready to go and you can put your little candle in it. So if you, well, Annabella finishes up there. If you uh, want to reserve your kit, you can call us uh, down at the library at the children's room at the Trenton Free Public Library. The number is 609-392-7188, extension 32. And let us know that you want to reserve one of the Young Artists uh, Club kits and we'll set it aside for you. All right, so I think Annabella and I went just finish this up off camera. Yes. All right. Thanks, everybody. Hold on a second. Bye. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for joining us. And keep an eye on this page and all of our other virtual programming uh, uh, offers.